Now the Padres open spring training the week after next. The Padres recently held their annual fantasy camp at the spring training facility in Arizona. I enjoyed the privilege of attending that camp and had the honor of meeting the lone woman at camp, Jesse Beckettall. Jesse is a lifelong Padres fan who uh, is attending camp for the third time. Since she last attended three years ago, Jesse was featured in People Magazine for her work off the field. This is amazing. If you're a Padres fan or a baseball fan, you've got to be here. Like I'm Jesse, born and raised in San Diego. They compliment you. You feel yeah. like a rock star every time, and you're playing baseball 24-7. She's a good ball player. She might be the best one in camp, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Now, I've heard from Andy Ashby that you are pretty good, and you're selling yourself short by saying you're not very good. What about that? They make you feel like a rock star, man. <laughs> That's all I have to say. Being the lone female in camp comes with its privileges. So here we are. You get Bob Melvin's office? I got Bob Melvin's office. Very, how much have you used the desk? Who are we starting today? <laughs> but those privileges can come back to haunt you in kangaroo okay, court. So first of all, everyone that's in camp right now, you're fined five dollars just for being here. <laughs> With Judge Andy Ashby presiding. You know what? She's living back there in the Taj Mahal and has her own room, own shower. And look, my own, you know, Coke. Oh, you've you got know? your own your own refrigerator. Yeah. You're living in the lap of luxury. I'm living it. You know, living in the penthouse, so that's uh, five bucks. <laughs> when she's not living the dream at Padres Fantasy Camp, Jesse teaches kindergarten. During the pandemic, she was recognized by People Magazine. Keeping the kinders' uh, attention over a screen is yeah. difficult, so they're all over putting their face in the screen, you know. Yep. What about you? Yeah. So right. she recruited her dog to assist in the virtual right. lessons. She's a corgi mix. Her name is uh, Ginger, but on camera she's Professor Ginger. Professor Ginger is going to help us play a game where we find all of the socks that are exactly the same. I found that they liked to watch those. It yeah. got their attention a little bit. Find the sock that's exactly the same as this sock. Okay. Good girl. I started making these videos. Um, threw them up on YouTube to share them with other teachers and took off a little bit, so it, it was a lot of fun. Hey! So, how's this like? This is awesome! Here, I'm gonna just show you guys. Out of both. Jesse was introduced to the Padres by her dad. I don't even know how young I was, but for some reason I loved it. Something about the magic of baseball. Um, I started playing at six because, as he knows, I have a lot of energy, so uh -huh. my parents put me in baseball and then after that softball, but I loved it. Even though I was a little kid, I didn't know what I was doing, just loved it. She went on to play softball at Madison High School and Cal Baptist University. You're the only female here. Do you feel like the only female or are these guys pretty welcoming? Everybody's cool, yeah. I just feel like part of the group. It's cool. Somebody um, said they came back for the Brotherhood and I agree. It's like a family. It's really cool. Jesse also played hoops at Madison. Oh! She can still hit a jump shot even while wearing cleats on concrete. But baseball remains her passion. She's been living that passion since she first saw Padres Fantasy Camp on Facebook a few years ago. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to do this. Because have you ever been a kid where you dream like, what if I were a major league baseball player? Obviously fantasy, I'm not that good, but now it comes true, you know, for a week. So I saw that, I have to do this. I have to do this. That was so much fun. I oh. love that story. She was one of the stars of the camp. Uh, she could play, the kindergarten teacher, using her yes. dog, all that stuff. She uh, really went and thought out of the box to get those oh, kids to learn. Absolutely. The Good for Third her. time at camp. She's a veteran there. <laughs> get Professor Ginger in the outfield next time. Thanks, John. <laughs>